Let's do it. Hey, uh, Thor here. Um, at the grandparents where we did the ghillie suit test a while ago. I'm going to do another one of those. Uh, we started doing one of those, and then something happened. And it hasn't been finished yet. But anyways, you'll, these will probably all be posted in, on Friday. Um, anyway, so today, instead of doing a normal airsoft gun review, we, uh, we're going to do this. Um, this is the uh, infamous Red Rider lever action BB gun. These use the not not airsoft BB, but 177 caliber copper coated BBs. Um, this is obviously it's made by Daisy, uh, and this is like the original 1938 model. This isn't the new one, so obviously there's on mine there's a little bit of rust and stuff on the barrel there. Uh, actual real wood hand grip, which is held in by a screw, and then this thing right here. Uh, real wood stock, which is bolted into the uh, frame. Uh, the lever is metal. Everything's metal because it's an older gun where they actually use metal to make things and. Uh, tube magazine and how you load it is you twist the cap on the end there you pour your BBs into the into there and then so and then they kind of go down the barrel around the barrel in here and then when you load this uh, cock back it loads a BB in and then you can shoot at stuff like these cans that we have over there and then or you can miss but This isn't going too well for some reason. I blame the wind. Let's pretend that didn't happen. I hit the can though. Let's pretend that happened. Alright, and um, just a couple shots of it. Generally more accurate. This is maybe 30 feet. I can hit things one time like that sometimes. Take some, take some time to aim. Or you can miss. Yeah, so, yeah, you can just load it really fast like that. It says it has the Daisy logo on the uh, lever right there. Um, as for how it feels, it feels really nice. It still works considerably well considering this is the uh, apparently, according to what is written on here, number uh, in the numbers, it's apparently. Where is it? I can't find it. Well, it was made in Arkansas, uh, the U.S. It says uh, number 1938. So this is the uh, model 1938. I don't know if it's was actually made in 1938, but um, my cousin, uh, who's behind the camera at the moment. We did some research, and that number is the date of manufacture as well as the patent number. Is underneath there. It says Daisy uh, reg registration number. Uh, and one thing that did happen though was there's there used to be like a sling mount type thing here, and then that was kind of just a little piece of metal went in between those, and then a, a metal loop that was on that. Uh, it broke off, so it doesn't have a sling mount anymore. But it's still in considerably better condition than some and then the difference between this one and the new one obviously the new one's probably gonna have a little bit more power um, also it doesn't have the sticker on it instead it has a little medallion in the uh, stock because you can't buy these ones anymore but it has a 75th anniversary medallion anyways that is uh, my moderately quick review of the uh, Daisy Red Rider uh, BB gun and, uh, alright, see ya.